With the help of surveillance video, seven people have now been indicted by a Pike County grand jury. Police became suspicious when multiple businesses in the area were missing money out of their vending machines. While most businesses had surveillance footage of the thefts, the perpetrators were unrecognizable. Police became frustrated until an attempted burglary occurred at the Pirate's Cove car wash in Belfry, and similar subjects tried to steal money from the change dispenser, causing thousands of dollars worth of damage. When I seen the video, I recognized the vehicle. I said, that's the vehicle and that's the, uh, the same subject or subjects that are in the vending machine thefts. Uh, so I contacted Sergeant Jimmy Nolte um, with the Kentucky State Police. Uh, he stated that he and Trooper Kurt Rowe were working on that and that they had put this out on social media in hopes to get some tips. The owner of the Pirate's Cove car wash received over 160 shares of her surveillance footage on Facebook. From that video, a subject was identified in Louisa. I contacted Chief Fugit. He began to provide me photographs of the vehicle that he suspected was the same one in the video. And in one of the photographs, on the dashboard of the vehicle, was the exact same hat that the subject had on in the attempted theft at the Pirate's Cove car wash. After interviewing the identified subject, he then led police to six others who were later charged. They were also involved in several other thefts, uh, not only in Kentucky, but possibly involved uh, in several thefts throughout the tri-state area. More suspects are expected to come forward. Reporting in Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.